Hi friends, I'm Jason, the marketing professor, and I teach everyone from the student to the CEO the essentials of marketing in five minutes or less. Let's get started. Today, I want to talk to you about the riches that are in the niches. Well, to make it rhyme, we'll just say the riches are in the niches. I've heard it pronounced both ways, so I'm just going to punt and we'll just call it niches for today. For your business, it's important to understand that not everyone is your customer. Now, it's easy to say everybody drives a car, everybody has shoes, everybody wears a hat, something along those lines. But what I want you to do instead is to focus 80% of your effort on one specific group of people. If you can do that, that's going to make your marketing much easier and it's going to give you a much higher return on your marketing dollar. Here's an example. I'm going to go back to the running shoes example that I've used from an earlier video. If you have a store that sells shoes, tennis shoes, running shoes, it's very easy to say, hey, I'm going to offer something for everybody, and it's okay that you do that. But if you spend 80% of your effort talking to the competitive runner, the type of runner who's willing to spend $150 to $200 on a pair of shoes, well, then you can spend your effort talking to that person. Maybe it's through a special events. Maybe it's through an ad in a triathlon magazine. Or maybe you can talk to them through affiliations with various clubs. The point I'm getting at is if you spend 80%, 80-20 rule here, 80% of your effort talking to this person, that other 20% is gonna be that casual runner, maybe the weekend warrior, somebody who just does 5Ks, somebody who's just willing to get in shape or wanting to get in shape, you're going to be able to talk to them organically. But the main customer you wanna to talk to, your niche, if you will, that competitive runner, well, that person's gonna to come to you, tell their friends and be more open to spending more money with you on a pair of shoes, therefore giving you a higher return on your marketing investment. Otherwise, here's what happens. If you've got your shoe store and you wanna to talk to everybody, you are putting so, so effort out in a variety of different directions. Instead, what you should be doing is putting all your effort into that one large direction to capture that main niche that you wanna to talk to. So your homework assignment, identify who your target niche is that you want to talk to and then be willing to hit the pause button or the restructure button on the marketing strategy that you have in place right now. Real win, if you don't have a marketing structure in place right now, well, you've got an opportunity to really focus it on this customer. That's all I've got for you today, my friends. If you like videos like this, do me a favor go ahead and hit like and go ahead and subscribe and reach out to me if there's something you want me to cover. You can find me on social media on all the places. Also, themarketingprofessor.net. I have an abundance of free resources there to help you and your business grow and succeed. I'll talk to you soon. Thanks for joining me. I'll see you.